What's up, Story Buds? How's it going? Friends of Bunny here. Welcome back to my channel. So, on our way to MegaCon 2019, and I'm going again with Nightmare. Hey. As always, traffic here is horrible in Orlando. I mean, for those especially that are from Orlando, you'll know. Uh, for those who are not from Orlando, it's like Mad Max Fury Road meets like because it's Florida. Throwing a couple of alligators, so yeah. Hey. But at least this time, I actually have a DSLR camera, which will maybe help with recording much better quality at the convention. And uh, yeah, I'm trying my best this year, especially with letting myself be a little bit more loose just recording this because there are so many times I like I have to keep like starting over starting over before I have to like edit out like an hour long video because of me trying to get it perfect so this year I'm just gonna let myself be loose and I hope you strawberry buds will enjoy it either way uh, but yeah right now I'm just trying so hard to just calm down because like I get a little bit anxious when we're like um, driving through Orlando, you know, trying to make it there because they never fix the roads, even though everything is always under construction. It doesn't make sense. Like, what are what are they actually accomplishing if it's always like this every year? So... Yeah, that's where we broke down last year. Yeah, for those who've seen <laughs> that vlog last year, last year, uh, wasn't really that pleasant trying to, like, arrive to Orlando. For any of you who have seen the video, uh, and for those who haven't, yes, like at the beginning, of, the beginning of the vlog, uh, my car just decided to start dying before we even got to our hotel. So that was great. Anywho, yes, I am so excited. Right now, we are actually headed to our very first Airbnb experience. I mean, at least for me. I don't know about Nightmare, but yeah, we're gonna be staying at an Airbnb, which is uh, when you get to stay at someone else's home that they're letting people, uh, like guests, um, like rent out for like a vacation trip or something. And so it's a lot more cozier from what I assume. Uh, so yeah, right now we're headed to that address uh, and our friend, uh, which we're actually meeting for the first time in person from Xbox, his name is Paradox. He's been his friend, his friend for quite a long time and my friend for like, shorter amount of time, but you know, either way. He's gonna... like a brother to me. A weird ginger brother. Love him to death. Yes, yeah, so we're gonna meet up with him uh, for the very first time in person. That'll be something. And uh, he's actually the one that uh, rented out uh, that Airbnb for us. Not just Nightmare and I, but we're also gonna be spending our Megacon trip with our new friends, like from last year's Megacon. Mikkel and Bloody Psych. Bloody Psych. Psych. Or Bloody Psychopath, but yeah, Bloody Psych for short. It just always gets crazy, you know, for Megacon, it seems. And like I just get a little bit like as you can see, just look at look at all look at all of this uh construction going on. Like I see this every single year. Like it never goes away. Like I, they never like finish anything. I don't understand what their where their <laughs> priorities are. Um uh, not here. Oh, and the, another difference from last year to this year is uh, I have blonde hair. So that's another new thing this year. And I got a new shirt. Can't really see it that much right now. There we go. Yeah, it says Tokyo. This road is never smooth. Why? Orlando, what's wrong? What's going on? Oh yeah, and earlier before I started, re started recording this, uh, there was this really, really crazy guy that literally like a split second just like drove by drove by us like at the speed of light in front of us and just cutting through all the cars like fast and furious and like it scared the bejeebers the bejeebers the bejeebies whatever the bejeebies the bejeebies <laughs> what are you I don't, Elma? I don't know why I'm I don't know why I'm using that word but it scared the life out of me it scared the life out of me like I because one second everything's just calm you know and then suddenly it's like oh my gosh like you could just see that guy I don't know 
how, but like, I, I just really hope that a cop seen, has, ha, like, is somewhere to, to, to see that because that guy's gonna cause someone to yeah, die. There's what? There's another guy trying to be a. It's not surprising here in Orlando. Pitbull free concert. We gotta go. I really would love to see Mr. Worldwide. Dale. I'm still trying to figure out this camera, so forgive me if like it's a little bit shaky or wonky or I zoom in or like zoom out when I'm trying to figure stuff out. So yeah, we're gonna meet up with our friend Paradox for the first time in person, and then we're gonna meet up with our friends that we made last year at MegaCon, Mikkel and Lady Psych. Uh, for those of you who follow me on Instagram, you'll know that I've already introduced them, and... Bloody Psychopath is one of our closest friends, even though she dies all the time in Dead by Daylight. Okay. Okay, this guy is trying to completely kill himself in front of everybody. Everybody's trying to kill themselves on here. Why? What's oh, wrong? Class in the Holy Land. That's where we're going to lead our next crusade. <laughs> nice. It's always sunny in Florida. Really? No, it's awful. Don't come here. Another thing too, I had to put on loads of sunscreen before like heading out because my air conditioning is not working in my car. Fun. And uh, yeah, I, I like cook in here more than this guy. Uh, oh, what's that <laughs> supposed to mean? It's because I'm Korean, isn't it? Because I'm pale, if you haven't noticed, or like I never really go outside much. I'll confess, uh, and yeah, I've I've already had a really ba uh, bad sunburn like a few weeks ago, like at a beach wedding, which I forgot I was gonna be at a beach. So, well, you didn't tell anybody. You kind of just wanted us all to die of equally. Yeah. So anyway, like I, I'm like extra cautious right now with my skin, mainly my arms, and especially with no air conditioning in my and especially with no con conditioning air conditioning in my car, like. The sun is just blazing, especially on this arm right here, since it's like by the window. It's just not fun, so. But overall, you know, we're just looking on the bright side of things, and we're excited for our trip, as always, because Megacon is always like an adventure, and like the, the most like interesting things happen there that in usual life, day to day life, never happens really. So. I have that one guy's haircut. <laughs> what? There's a guy last year whose haircut was just phenomenal. Bald in the front, oh. a little bit of rat tail in the back. Beautiful. Man, you guys can probably tell how bumpy this road is just how much my camera's shaking. Yeah, like my I'm trying, I'm trying so hard to grab onto this camera, just like, like very still, but no, no. But um, yeah. So it's gonna be the first time, I believe, uh, especially for our, our friend Paradox to be on camera. I'm not sure, especially like in a vlog, but, but uh. Yeah, he, he said he's cool with being on video, so we'll see how that is. And uh, our friend Mikkel, uh, for those of you uh, that don't know, he has his own YouTube also, and uh, it's really awesome. You guys should check it out. Uh, so he's probably, it's probably not going to be new to him to be on camera, so we'll see how that goes. And um, our friend Bloody Psych, she said it was cool too, so. Actually, Paradox is a podcast. I'll ask him what it is. By the way, that mountain is a smoking. podcast? Yeah, I guess. What's smoking? That mountain. It's like a Hawaiian area. Is that supposed to be like a Lilo and Stitch ride? <laughs> oh, Hana. <laughs> aloha, aloha, hey. aloha, aloha, hey. And there's traffic. Uh, Beautiful. I hate, I really hate those really hard stops. Uh, I'm sorry. No, I know. It's Orlando. You kind of have no choice, but you know. Is that blood on that rail? Where? I don't know if that's blood. Buy oil. But yeah, look at this lovely traffic. Just look at it. Isn't it beautiful? Let's just look at this random car for a second. <laughs> like, I'm like, you're filming me. I'm I don't this. care. <laughs> car commercial. Now. <laughs> I am cooking in this car. I'm surprised. I'm the one wearing all black. <sighs> Only 30 more minutes to go. I need to clean this lens. Mm. I mean, maybe it doesn't show on video, which which is nice, but I, yeah, there's like a little like, smear. I see you in the random patron. 
It's a lovely day though. I mean, aside from the clouds. All right, gonna meet up with Paradox. Then we shall give you a little tour of the Airbnb. They're all different, but um, usually we'll give you a little tour of that Airbnb and like, if it turns out to be like a great experience, you know, we'll maybe leave our review <laughs> and like a little montage of everything that uh, was in there, all the nice, clean, quality, arranged things. Whoa! What happened? <laughs> Look! Look at that. On the road again. Mm -hmm. Can't wait to be on the road again. To make it all the way to our friends. <laughs> what? Can't wait to be on the road again. What do you say? Road again! Oh look, it's Hogwarts Express. lady was like I want them to have like a chola accent. <laughs> I wanted to have a chola accent. You don't accent. want that. Yes, I do. Third left like, is, at the exit is, no, This is, It's my life. Cherry Blossom. You're beautiful. No, I'm not. Yes, you are. No. That fat guy right You're there beautiful. is hot. You're beautiful. I just see myself. Oh. What the f That robot looks like he's just seen some shit. Look at that shit. So, what is one of the number one things you're looking forward to on our trip? Uh, love bug season ending because I hate watching them have sex in front of me. I'm like, oh, you get off my. Ah! They're alive. You, you sick. Oh, they're gone. They left. Good. I can agree. They're very annoying. I don't like having animals have sex in front of me. That's weird. <laughs> this is a Christian car. This is a Christian channel. <laughs> Edward Scissorhands. Made it to our Airbnb. Now to give you a tour. So this is what you see when you first walk in. Hi. Hello. <laughs> and that's our friend Paradox. Hey. Can we show you my bedside right? Good thing.
we get a nice stove to cook things. Different from staying at a hotel. Get a microwave. And we get things like glass cups. Get a nice sink. We get a coffee maker, which is always something someone needs in the mornings. Yeah. We got plates. We got plenty of plates and plenty of cups. Oh yeah. We're set. And uh, toaster. Sweet. What's in here? Ooh, wooden spoons. More spoons. Oh no, this is this this will probably be very important for us to have just in case, you know. And this is a dishwasher that comes with the Airbnb. This fridge did not come with food, but you know, uh, it's understandable. Let's get this pantry to put our stuff in. It already came with some stuff, but I could put more in there later on. Hi. Hey, what's up? <laughs> We got a clock. Sexy. This a nice painting of wherever this is. But it has boats. Emergencies. And we have a map. <laughs> and licenses. Yeah. Cool. And in here, we have laundry and washer. Where are the lights? Oh, it's right here. Yay. And right in here, we have. A game room. I don't know why that's there. He gave us a nice pool table for any of us that want to play pool, along with air hockey and a poster of Yoda and this poster right here that says Yeehaw in America. And we have that thing that no one ever uses. And this may or may not come in handy depending on how crazy we get. Ooh, I got lighter in here. Nice. But it was very delayed. <laughs> that was the game room. And we get this nice, lovely dining area. We will have a wizard's meal here. Yes. A hero's feast. With sunflowers. <laughs> what does that say? What? B A R A B N B N. You are the Spanish one. How can you not? I don't know what that means. Para Biennis. So what does that mean? That's <laughs> not what it means. Sorry. Beaver. That's <laughs> not what it means. I always like these slanted rooms. They're strange. That makes the room seem bigger. And the acoustics in here are marvelous. Marvelous. We got some <laughs> nice <laughs> pillows. <laughs> but there's one thing I was wondering. Very What's soft. That? And one of my favorite <laughs> things, we get our own pool. Nice outdoor table, chairs, and a nice screen roof so that the bugs can stay away from us. And we got this screen too. Interesting. We have two lounging chairs. And we get pool rules. I don't think we'll need them. <laughs> We're mature. And this is a closet we're not allowed to open. It's only for the owners. Understandable. And uh, what's in here? Oh. Have our nice little pantry. Ooh, we have hair dryers. That's gonna be needed. We have pillows and towels. Ooh, okay. Nice. I brought my own towel just in case, but it's always good to have extra. And we get bathroom. And we got rules for using this toilet. Can respect that. We got a trash can, a sink, then you got this weird alien right here. That was a hallway bathroom. This lovely patterned geometric bed. And this head thing, I'm just kidding, this actually I brought for my wig so that I can style it some more before the convention. His name's Bob. And a nice dresser. Put our clothes in, of course, or you know, whatever we need to put in. Yeah, we get our own square with local channels, I would I would assume. I don't know 
if we have cable or like if uh, we have all like the channels in the universe but hey we have a TV we have a square my stuff I gotta test the softness ooh that actually is soft actually that is really soft I like it I always love good quality pillows and yeah we got a fan which doesn't have a light bulb honestly I don't understand that but as long as there's a fan in here because you know Florida and we got this other lovely artwork of beaches I don't know uh, Costa Brava Malaga uh, yeah and in our room we get we get to use this majestic bathroom I'm so happy and nightmares too because especially for me because I need I need all this lighting you know it's like for um, makeup and cosplay and all that stuff and we got we got we got so many artworks on these walls these people are shit they're serious I've always wanted a bathtub like this I don't know why it just there's a lot of room for my legs because they're they're long and shower glass door shower speed things up because my camera's dying I might have to edit footage in later. Ooh, we got a safe. Should close this door. Nobody will know what I'm up to. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'll be back. I'll be back. I love how this lovely sunset is like right above this magnificent invention. It just takes you to another world. My eyes are filled with glory. I'm seeing this majestic sight. Okay, I'm getting crazy. Let's get out of here. Very spacious. Excellent. I like this shirt. Got it at Target. It just says Tokyo on it. I thought it was cute. I like Tokyo. I like Japan. Don't judge me. And a plant. These plants are important. They're important for the environment. This is like the cutest little modem or whatever this thing is. <laughs> Look at the size of it. It's adorable. What is this? Oh, it's another pantry. We got Finding Nemo. And we have uh, another dresser. And hey, there's me again. Hi, I'm a shadow. Okay, so um, yeah, remotes. The usual, you yeah. know? And another cute little modem. Comcast. And, uh, that doesn't make sense. Okay, <laughs> for a second I couldn't see the numbers. I think it's just the camera because it doesn't show that in real life. The numbers are actually fine. Anyway, yes, alarm clock may most likely be needed to wake up for the convention on time. Lamp and closet with more Finding Nemo. These people really love Nemo famous. And a last bathroom. We got this very beautiful flower, which is not real. And this thing, which I assume is to make things smell good in here. Yeah. These rugs are really nice and soft. <laughs> Sorry, that's weird. <laughs> I like soft things. And of course the toilet with another piece of art above it. Do you like Take you to another universe, another world, and a shower. I said. I thought you said nickel. I said Michael, <laughs> nickel, nickel, nickel. All right. Why do you have to like say your M as an N? Mikael. All right. So that guy, yeah. his car fell out the bottom. So. What? Yeah, it came a little extra time. Like, what? on the side of the road extra time? Kinda. I don't know. They said it'll be a little bit. It happened before, so it'll be okay. Several minutes later.
Cracker Barrel. Okay. I need everybody to do me a favor. I've never been here before. Right. Everybody do me a favor. This is the first time. Everybody do me a favor. Come here. Oh, wait. Before we do that, let me set all these up. I'm going to kick the bottom of the tent. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, ow, wait, there's a bar here. <laughs> <laughs> Watch out, things are coming. Yes, she got me more. Is there any spirits in Cracker Barrel, please? Tell me the lottery numbers. <laughs> <laughs> this is like secured to the table. I can't add it to the wall. I can't kick it. Oh my god. Oh, let me show the Somebody flip the table once. <laughs> Yo, Martha! Oh my God. It's like the stabbing the forehead oh, with the... Stop. 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 I don't know how I got these scars. <laughs> no. My grandpa was a little bit of a I got a little cold. And you were sure. You got the job. Grandma didn't like that. Not one bit. So, me. <laughs> laughing why I did it. Watch Grandpa. Take the grandma. And then he looked at me and said, Why so serious? He put it in her hand. <laughs> Why so serious? Oh my god. <laughs> Why so serious? Why so serious? Amen. <laughs> Best Luigi bowl. Best Luigi. Luigi. <laughs> so yeah, we're at Cracker Barrel, and this is Bloody Psych. Mickle. I'm infected. <laughs> and there's Nightmare the again, and Paradox. Yeah, we're just waiting for our food right now. <laughs> They're making the time of their lives right here. Now boys, play nice. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> what is this? It's a new board. Just, just grab, grab one. You are a pirate. We got to survive. What? Breathe deeply. Wait a minute. This piece is smaller than the other. Oh my god. It's a conspiracy. Illuminati. <laughs> this is segregation. <laughs> this is a historic reenactment of the past 300 years. I thought I was riding a king. Is that meat in there? We know what we gotta do, right? You're such a vegan. <laughs> Think about it. Think about it. Powerpuff was a really weird plot. Some dude in his garage is like, "Unmake the girls." <laughs> that have no fingers. Wait a minute. We don't. Yeah. Also, what happened to the no wife? Do they ever though. explain what happened yeah, to the, the wife of like the professor? So the chemical X was actually her body parts jumped in line. <laughs> I don't know why the Powerpuff Girls didn't have hands, so they could protect themselves. <laughs> no, the Professor Oak like a little bit. <laughs> And also, why did he have a monkey? What was he doing with that? Was he spanking it? Was he spanking the little monkey? He didn't have a monkey. We're missing one very key ingredient. The rowdy rough board. Who in the world is breathing? Seriously, this child. This child is like a monkey. You know how we have You want to know how we fix that? Here's a life lesson. If you ever have a screaming child in a restaurant, get behind them and go to sleep all night. Back at the Airbnb from Cracker Barrel, <laughs> and throughout that time, I was charging my camera battery because it died before we got to go. So now that it's all charged up, let's continue. Hey, Paradox. Hey. <laughs> We're killing a bug upstairs. Lovely. Still right there. What is that? I don't know. Hey. Oh. <laughs> what? I got a Big Hero 6, Shark Avalanche, and Death Knot. Death Knot? Oh, yeah. Let me see. The last dinosaur. The last airbender. <laughs> <laughs> the last dinosaur. Not the last dinosaur. The, uh, the good dinosaur. Should we, yeah. should we watch this while like, cosplaying? Like, yes! <laughs> Bang! <laughs> She's got a gun! Bang! Arts and crafts! <laughs> Catch the gun! Why not? <laughs>
Yeah. No! <laughs> I found the batteries. <laughs> you son of a <laughs> I'm just chilling on this very nice couch. Wall nightmare is just trying to figure out how to connect the TV and the Xbox that he brought. Michael, we play Dead by Daylight! Why are you people on the killer, alright? We're not having Paranoxia as the killer. That was a mistake to let happen last time. Well, just because I study different types of things that work well together, which makes it hell for everybody playing the game. No! I know! I've been there! Like, I haven't been in six years. What? What? For later. Maybe. Read for her pleasure. I am Thor! So she's gonna be like walking around like this? Lovely. <laughs> yes, this is when you get your signed. So, what colors do you want? I'm probably gonna take. Hey, Grandpa. <laughs> <laughs> take blue, because I know you like blue. What mm -hmm. is. That's purple. You want purple? Maybe green from Adonia. Right? Is that a TV? What is that sound? Your TV was on, you didn't know? No. When I came up here the first time, lights were off, it was just static on the TV. Yo, haunted! What kid himself in that room? <laughs> Maybe there's a Ouija board in there. Well, we did play Ouija at Country Country Bear, so. That's true, we sure did. Mm-hmm. We've been tricked. Call the landlord, but look, Lord, look. This yeah. room is haunted. Hey, Bob. All right, time for bed. Hopefully, I uh, in the next video, unless this is going to be a one video type thing, all into one video, Megacon, uh, you'll see more things that we do behind the scenes, as in aside from Megacon, here at the Airbnb or just anywhere else. Today we just focused on arriving to the Airbnb and getting all settled in, and now we must sleep. <laughs> because we are very exhausted and we have a big four days ahead of us. Yeah, I didn't. I decided not to film the entire time so that I could uh, just settle in with everyone. I hope you buds are okay with that, but I'll definitely have a whole lot more to show you in the upcoming days. I am so tired, everybody else is too. Like I've just finished playing <laughs> Cards Against Humanity with my buds. Mickle, Bloody Psych, and Paradox. Nightmare felt too exhausted, too sleepy, too tired to play, so he just decided to go to bed before us. But yeah, we had a good time playing Cards Against Humanity. It was really fun. It's always a fun time with that game, and we laughed so hard. Um, but yeah, now I'm just going to brush my teeth and get ready for bed, get ready for Dreamland in the most comfiest bed that they gave us. I'm so thankful. Thank you, lady who owns this place. Although the Wi-Fi, we still did get that situated. Hopefully that'll, that'll be fixed by tomorrow, otherwise we're gonna have issues, but... Either way, we'll find ways to entertain ourselves. No biggie. By the way, this is my new Death Note shirt that Nightmare got for me at GameStop. I'm using it as my PJs. My favorite character from the show. It's just a really big t-shirt. 
I thought it fit for the occasion of this trip. You know, you know what I mean? Going to dreamland now. I'm really tired and I'm. Oh, my eyes feel really heavy and I just want to enjoy the comfortness of that amazing bed. Those amazing pillows. Oh my gosh, I want a bed like that in the future. Why don't I have that already? Why don't I have a bed like that already? I don't know. I need a, I need to work harder to achieve comfort in my bed. Comfortness. Quality. Anywho, I'm rambling. I look forward to experiences we're gonna have tomorrow. Whatever that may be, tomorrow is actually not going to be the first day of MegaCon just yet because we actually made it to the Airbnb two days before the convention. So today is the 14th from when I'm recording this. Tomorrow will be the 15th. Well, technically right now, just later because we've stayed up really late playing Cards Against Humanity. <laughs> love the shirt and I'm just really loopy right now because it's like 3 a.m. in the morning and yeah right now nightmare ow nightmare is sleeping in the most comfortable bed ever oh it's amazing I can't wait to just lay in it and just go into a different dimension different universe I need a bathroom like this the lights up The same as heaven would. By the way, here's a glimpse of my camera. Canon SO2. If you're interested, you know, a lot of people are always curious of like what camera uh, the content creator is using for their videos. Well, this is the one I use. This is my first DSLR camera, by the way. If you like the quality, Canon SL2. I'll leave a link in the description. You see that? You see the blur? You see the focus? That's what I wanted for years and I finally have it. It's just like... A dream come true. <laughs> I'm gonna press the stop button and go to bed. It is 3 a.m. in the morning. I need to go to sleep. I need to stop rambling. Like, there's no reason for this. Why am I doing this to myself? I don't know. I think it's because I'm, like, worried that I'm not really saying anything interesting or entertaining enough to engage. <laughs> you buds let me know. Only you buds can actually clarify. <laughs> This is just me being me. Start dancing. That's what you gotta do in life. You gotta do that and not care about what people think or say. Bedtime, Fresno Bunny. Bedtime. You gotta, you gotta go to bed. You, you, need, you need to stop. You are literally letting pa time pass and you're losing sleep and doing this literally for no reason. You need to stop. Do, do any of you buds ever have this issue or any of you beings have this issue where you literally are harming yourself you're like your own worst enemy you're just making yourself do things that are unnecessary that are hurting yourself and that annoys you it's like what in the world is going on i don't understand anyway I, i'm really tired good night see you in the morning So that I wouldn't have to like do it all over again. You know, the eyeliner. 
I could just retouch it up and just wipe whatever is <laughs> smudged. <sighs> I don't know if I have allergies or what, but every time I wake up, I always feel like sneezing a lot and my nose starts running. It's really weird. I never like had this issue before. Why am I why 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 is my nose doing this all of a sudden? Maybe I have allergies now. As an adult. That sucks. Whatever. Okay. I'm gonna go say good morning to everybody. Morning. Morning. What the f are you wearing there? Oh, chocolate chip. Like Push it out. Good night. Like, <laughs> what are you doing? I get to pack. I want to be hot. As a kite. I mean, I'm trying to find this video. And then I'm welcome to it. Like, oh, look what they did. What the f did they do in our house? Life. We can just be sitting there having like a normal conversation for maybe five minutes, and then we'll be like, Hey, what the f do you watch? Like, Beer. <laughs> Outside. Yeah, really. Yeah. This new pack of bacon is like perfectly shaped. <laughs> I approve of this bacon. It was a nice breakfast. Thank you, Nightmare and Mickle, for making pancakes and bacon. So my buds, Mickle, Bloody Psych, and Paradox were talking about what we should do today, and I believe we've decided to go on a cruise. This is going to be my second time ever being on a cruise. For those who follow me on Instagram, I've posted beforehand, like I think like a year ago or something. Um, that I've gone to my very first cruise ever, and this is the same cruise we're gonna be going on today, possibly. I'm so excited if that's the case. Hopefully they'll let me record it, because it was so much fun last year. If it was last year, yeah, I believe it was last year, yeah. I don't know, my memory is a little bit foggy right now. I just woke up. Till then, enjoy the little montage of things that we do before we arrive to the cruise. I really hope that the wind of the cruise, you know, being, on the ocean is not going to mess up my hair. I've spent so much time straightening it because my hair is naturally wavy. And I mean, I love my wavy hair, but honestly, I love seeing how it looks when it's straight too. I always have <laughs> dark eye circles like I had. I try, I, I literally try to cover them up so much, but I think they're just, they're just going to be there. I think they're just, they're just part of my genetics. <laughs> Aside from the cruise, I don't know. I don't know what else we're going to be do doing today. <laughs> Pronounce things clearly, please. Press the bunny. Yes. Yes. Okay. I'm trying. I don't know why. I, I, I think my brain, <laughs> my mind gets ahead of myself of like what I want to say. My mouth cannot keep, my, see? <laughs> my mouth cannot keep up. I wonder how much more lighting I can create if I open up the blinds. Is it this one the right one? No, it's this one. Nope, it's not that one, it's this one. Ooh, that's nice. Really nice lighting. I really love how big this room is. We, I believe, got the master bedroom. And this is a king size bed, oh yeah. Honestly, Paradox picked this room first. If you're watching Paradox, I'm sorry. Um, honestly, I didn't really care either way, but Thank you. Right now everybody is just in the living room playing video games. Mainly uh, Nightmare and Paradox, I believe. It's a lovely day though. 
Look. <coughs> Sorry. Such a beautiful day. The sun is out. And the pool is calling my name. I don't know if I'll swim today or tomorrow, but I'm definitely going to swim one of these days. Oh yeah, I'm excited. Also, I apologize in advance um, if during uh, this whole vlog, most of the time I'm not like talking to the camera. Um, I forget to. That's just really what it is. I, I just forget to talk every now and then because I, want, I really want you buds to feel like you're involved and that you're here and that I know you're here. Sometimes I just uh, forget and I just record something that I think is funny and just to show you buds and most of the time I just end up not really talking to the camera or you know just going about just sharing the update of what's going on and just, just chatting so yes I, I hope you forgive me for that I'll try to remember each time like um, in, in between to like <laughs> talk to you buds every once in a while so that you're actually here hanging with us, you know? You guys are actually here, and I'm talking to you, even if everybody else is around me. Sometimes it just, there's a little bit of that awkward feeling and that sort of thing, but really it doesn't really bug me. I just, I just, I'm just an awkward person, so like, even though I really don't care, like sometimes my anxiety tells me that I do care, but I really don't, so it's confusing. I don't know, life. When we walked in last night to go to bed, um, you know, through our door right here. Um, Nightmare was was just like, oh gosh, please, can you please like put him somewhere else or like turn his head or something? Cause that freaked me out. And I'm like, that's Bob. He's my model, my hair model. Also, I did not get it on camera. I'm sorry, but uh, last night, um, before we started playing cards against uh, against humanity, um, like the upstairs TV in Mickle and Bloody Sykes' room suddenly turned on. We were wondering what that sound was. It sounded like people were talking upstairs, but it was their TV. It turned on out of nowhere. Is this place haunted? I guess we'll find out if in the case the, the ghosts or the spirits want to make themselves present while we're staying here. It's more where that came from. All right. Yes, that was a nightmare. <laughs> that's how. That's when you can tell that uh, they're playing video games. By the way, when he's playing video games. Sorry about that, though. I, I might have to censor that. I'm not sure. I'm not really monetizing my videos, so I don't know if that'll really matter. But it's YouTube, so you never know. I have to go in the living room and join everybody, watch them play video games, and maybe play some myself. Also, I really hope it does not rain while we're in the cruise. That was paradox. <laughs> um, but yeah, I really hope it does not rain when we're on the cruise because I'm bringing my camera if if, if they allow me. <laughs> Sorry about that. If they allow me uh, to bring my camera, hopefully, I really do hope. Um, and yeah, I do not want it to get wet. Tomorrow, and just for a reminder, tomorrow is the first day of MegaCon, so. I have to like actually style my wig a little bit more before um, we go tomorrow. Um, that's why I brought my styrofoam head. I'm gonna put my wig on there and then use hairspray, a particular hairspray that I bought, uh, just to like lift up the, the layers, you know, to match more of Midoriya's hairstyle. Crazy hairstyle, crazy awesome hairstyle, so that it looks a little bit more like him. I mean, so far I pretty much like the way I trimmed it. it like it almost like fits like his character and I'm personally happy with it already but you know just to add that special little touch I'm gonna do that I'm gonna do that uh, today maybe tonight uh, before tomorrow and hopefully it turns out well and then it stays and that we just have a fabulous day tomorrow tomorrow it's gonna start at 4 p.m. the first day always starts later in the day which in some ways I do love because it gives us plenty of time to just rest, to get up, not feel rushed, and just be there on time. But it's going to end at 8, so it's only going to be like 4 hours. Um, either way, I'm, it's still a lot of time and I'm excited. Uh, but then the next day, it's going to start at like 9, 8.30 or 9, I don't remember. And so we're going to have to wake up really early because this place we're staying at is like 30 minutes away from the convention center. Yes, that is kind of far. That's okay, Paradox. We still we still appreciate that all that you did for us, like for our stay. 
We really do. Um, and so yeah, we're gonna, we're gonna have to wake up uh, a little extra early so that we uh, leave here like an hour before so that we can get to the convention center and not have to worry about parking or traffic. So yeah, that was just a little update. On with the vlog. I should have just used a freaking knife. I'm not clumsy at all. I'm ashamed of myself. Let's try this again with a knife this time. Get out of the way! <laughs> I got diarrhea! <laughs> Get 
I have 17 pockets, which one did you put it in? <laughs> Us. Oh. We have to go on the left one. Hi, I would like to have $20 worth of quarters, please. Can you break a check? <laughs> I need $4,000 worth of... Hello. Do you mind if you get some change for that if I can? That's possible? No? Alright. $125 need a, need a quarter. I need a quarter? Need right. a quarter. I got a quarter. You got a quarter? Okay, he's got a quarter. Are you having a good day today? Alright, here's a quarter, sir. Thank you very much. Yeah. Have a great day. He doesn't have, he doesn't have any good day. And he had insult the injury. He even gave me the white guy smile of a disapproval. My favorite! My man! Hey, we're in Africa! Look at all those cheetahs! <laughs> yeah, it's all right. yeah, it's all right. This music expresses just how serious we are to get to the, the cruise on time. Yeah. We need to see Chi Yeah, we're acting totally serious right now with the way ah. this one's acting. Yeah, totally serious. I act wonderful. Uh-oh. Oh. <laughs> you got a $50 bill? No. Here. It's a you made it harder for us to read. One. Are you having a good day? Thank you. <laughs> Complete overhead. No one wants to tell me the day is good. I mean, being a American seems to suck. Yeah, it does. So. So I gotta be a China man. <laughs> I don't have to do your rules. You can suck on. <laughs> you dropped the soap. Hand it to me. Hey, we, should, we have to budge. <laughs> Give me my phone. <laughs> I can't see. Oh. <laughs> All right, your turn. Go. My turn. Oh, your turn. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Hell yeah. He does not say that. <laughs> Shut up. I know what this is. Got <laughs> myself a number. All right, then. Never mind. Never mind. The one I know that you'll understand because we listen to each other's hearts. But I'm never too far apart. And maybe love is the reason why. Eye to eye. That's it, I'm gonna jump! Jump then! <laughs> jump!
Oh my gosh. Really? I found Chi Chi's weapon. Oh my god. Is this Orca? Oh, I want this. Wait, we have a pool. I love it. I know. We have a pool. I want to go into that pool tomorrow. Hair and body wash. Two. I don't feel normal. Why do you say that? No, my eyes are fuzzy. I don't. I feel tired. You're tired. You've had alcohol. You're not wearing sunglasses. And Brian's in the store. Not a really great combination. I have a zuka. <laughs> I have a square zuka. Can I make them in the near future? Mm, not, not really. I mean, it is a little bit smudged. Well, like, it's smudged yeah, yeah, but it doesn't look messy. <laughs> <laughs> just for men. Just what you need. I'm trained, so. Why does it look like William Defoe, but like oh, super young? I don't know. I don't need shaved though. I don't need multiple hairs. Did you bring the other blades? I have four blades. Oh my god. I need one. Dude. Okay. Fingers are actually eating something. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. I'm tired and I need I need a kick in the ass of. Yeah. The cruise was nice, though it got dark really quickly, so I'm sorry about that. But I had quesadillas, it was really good, and I saw a dolphin. See, so yeah, right now we're at Walmart. Right now we're at Walmart. Just trying to restock on some things that we forgot. Then it's back to the Airbnb, where we just chill until we go to bed. To start Megacon tomorrow. I'm so tired. I love it when Walmart is like empty. There's no traffic. We're finally back at the Airbnb. It took us like about three hours to get back. And I'm so out of it right now. We left at 12. <laughs> it's 3. I'm gonna get changed and I'm gonna go to Dreamland. Tomorrow's the big day. You ready? Time to get ready. Decided to open up a shop after his music career flop. And so what do you went, think? It went down south. It's filthy Frank. <laughs> filthy. Uh. Hey, boss, can I get please? All right, what am I gonna be on right now? Oh, you're gonna be on YouTube. How's oh, it taste? Oh hell yeah. <laughs> <laughs> 
What do you think? Give me all your money! Oh. The man who walked a thousand miles of all our Give me your money! Oh. How's it taste that? Fair enough. So good, man. So good. I can't get enough. A magic trick. What? I'm gonna put my finger in the plug socket. Senpai. That's me. How'd that feel for you? Oh man, I feel like I just passed a kidney stone. Ooh. Ugh. First day of the con, how do you feel, Midoriya? Not you! Get out of here! So, Midoriya and Kachan, how do you guys feel about the first day of the con down? He needs to leave. <laughs> what did I do? He needs to go away. Who's the cuter Midoriya? I'm better than any of them. Damn. <laughs> oh, don't stop working it, honey. I see you. I see you, boo. Ooh. Ooh, kill him. Get it, Kevin. Frank is on a mission. It's all about you, baby. Give me this little. Ooh. Ooh. Like Scooby Doo. Where are you? You look at me when I'm talking to you, Scooby Doo. God damn it. Still after the first day of Manicon? Midoriya, what do you think? Okay, what about you, employee number 16? Okay, what about you, Paradox? It was good. You have a good time? Everything I wanted to do today was good. And I got done. Food. You got free food? free food? And I got to see what God looks like. What God looks like? Ricardo Milos. Oh. Ooh, here we go. All right, everybody, day one down, three more to go. Hey! <laughs> Together. All right, on the count of three, one, two, three. See that? <laughs> I want that on MTV. Hi, right, welcome back to another Michael Vlogs. Yes, this, this is the new vlog channel I'm making. Seriously? Yes. Hi. Look at that. Yes. What's the vlog going to be about? Like, like, move that leg so I can sit down properly. Move that leg. It's gonna suck. Get down here, Yeah. I'm looking move. We're gonna watch it tonight. You ready? Alright, oh, can we all go swimming first? We need to go swimming in that pool. Scoot over, scoot over. This is my last thing. It's all heavy, yeah? Daddy. Oh, there we go. What did you press? What did you press? <laughs> I'm helping, you know? <laughs> Jane Suppers 
ready. I said. But this is like the stereotypical Ireland like accent in Yubilla. Like or something like that. Year. Brilliant location, great size and love the pool. We've had a jam packed two weeks. Love to stay here again. Okay. Got a wonderful stay in their beautiful home, very comfortable and very well equipped. Had everything we needed. Why are these people getting better times than we are? <laughs> <laughs> he came back from the store. Oh, Make it. <laughs> 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 the sock in the bed. <laughs> There's a sock in my bed underneath the sheets. Wait, what? Uh, wait, kid size or adult size? <laughs> that was one of us. That was not us, yeah. Just pull up the, the very top covers and it's a black and white sock. Oh, my God. You got it's... like... Oh. Kids up. If you're making the beds... She's just like, <laughs> I'm gonna trick them. Well, no, like, I was. I feel like I'm gonna find you in here. <laughs> I think you gotta worry about it possibly being in your bed. Uh, I don't wanna find Nemo. Yeah. Find a useless <laughs> animal foot. I'm gonna sleep on the windowsill. <laughs> We're gonna leave notes before we leave. There were flies and we a, found a sock. sock. We found a sock. <laughs> there was a toilet paper. The Wi Fi was out when we got here. We have, like, we have some interesting stuff to put yeah, there. Yeah, seriously. Everybody's like, we had a lovely stay, but a barbecue would have been nice and it's a well sized pool. We're gonna tear up the pages. The stairs hurt my crotch. <laughs> See, that's why I don't believe him every time he says he is. <laughs> Outlet piece. That's why I said like three times! You just don't listen! 
Have a good day, man. I'm back. <laughs> <laughs> well, you're under arrest. That's so bad. Oh my god. He's getting text message. Hey, Jake, I'm kind of trying to watch that. <laughs> wow. She was right? Yeah. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. <laughs> you gotta go to bed and get your hat back. Special Asian jump. <laughs> Boy, get down. Jake Long always gets his man. Not a man. Jake Long always gets his woman. <laughs>
How did the pictures go for you? I take that as a resounding maybe. No, I'm kidding. Oh, great. You got to meet him. He said hi. Um, I said hello. He shook hands. Uh, he the is, sleeping he baby. so nice. He's a nice guy. Yeah, he's a nice yeah, guy. Yeah, he actually gave his temper. temper. Shorter than I thought so. Yeah, just cool guy, though. Yeah. He looked bigger on camera. Oh, yeah. <laughs> sure. Deku, how do you feel? I feel plus ultra right now. What about All Might right there? He's just hanging. He's just waiting until something happens with the city. How do you feel about being amongst your herd? I feel very connected to my spiritual self. And then there's Aizawa. One, two, three! on the haters all my ooh ooh yeah. giving that all for one <laughs> <laughs> what are you doing you're supposed to be professional oh my god <laughs> oh that's right all my flex it in there yeah get that pose boy let all the lovely mamas out there know you're always there for that all for one <laughs> United States of Smash, baby. <laughs> Remember, we don't care what you do, just don't wake us up. <laughs> so stay asleep. No! I will see you on therapy. Okay, next up. Oh, oh, oh no. Are you dabbing? It is 2019, Majoria. Dab on those Class B people. Ooh. <laughs> I love it. Michael! Where is Michael? Where did my Michael? I need your help. Come here, baby. Come here, Boobala. <laughs> Get out of here, Robbie! <laughs> now, now, if you really want to have fun, both of you! Ah, oh, double up! Perfect! Oh my god, you fly! Hope you both are enjoying the convention so far. Hope you both are enjoying the video so far. My friends and I are having an epic time.
Uh, so today was such a great day at MegaCon. Got so many photos with awesome cosplayers. I got to meet up with my Hero Academia series to take photos all together and laugh <laughs> about all the random hilarious things that's happened. I don't know why my face is like not focusing right now. Come on, it's my face. It looks like a face. Focus, camera. Okay, it's not it's not gonna wanna focus. It was, it was so incredibly difficult to get out that comfy bed. I'm not really gonna get much sleep again, but you gotta do what you gotta do. Especially if you've waited for like a whole year for MegaCon or just any convention in general that you paid for. So, yeah, you gotta do what you gotta do. Alright, so, I'm gonna go to bed and looking forward for day three. Let's see what happens. And hopefully, if I'm lucky, hopefully, I'll get to meet the voice actor, the English voice actor of Midoriya. Yeah. So, I guess that's it for day two. I also wanted to thank um, all of the awesome cosplayers that have asked me to take a photo with them and especially tag me and uh, mention me in their photos. Thank you so much. It means a lot and ugh, my face just keeps blurring out. Whatever, I can't do much better right now. I gotta improvise. I want to thank you cosplayers. You guys are awesome and just you convention goers. Just awesome beings in general. Um, I loved a lot of your cosplays, by the way, especially from My Hero Academia. They were awesome. And, uh, yeah, I am having a blast. This is, I, I know I say this every year, but, like, so far I feel like this Megacon is one of my most favorite, um, experiences of Megacon. Like, ever, should I say. Literally, like, um, I always experience, like, at least one like, new thing at MegaCon. That's why I love MegaCon so much, but it's always a really good experience for me. A lot of amazing experience for me, so... Um, let's see what tomorrow holds for not just I, but my buds Mickle, Bloody Psych, Paradox, and... Nightmare. Camera, can you just focus on my face? It's a face. Do not get it. Stay. Focus. My one thing that's a bit of a challenge for me is, like, aside from actually, like, getting up once I open my eyes, knowing that I have to wake up, or get up, um, otherwise I literally mess out on putting on my cosplay, is putting on my eye contacts. It takes me so long, and it irritates my eyes, like, trying to put them in, but then it, like, you know, it feels better after, after a little while, but trying to put them in, my eyes just keep wanting to blink, and my eyelashes keep pushing them away, and I'm just sharing this information, I mean, for those who might be able to relate, uh, but yeah, that's one of the, like, the biggest struggles, especially if you're, like, on a, on a time schedule, and you gotta make sure... You get that out of the way so you can get ready with your cosplay. That's like the most difficult part for me, I would say. Putting on my eye contacts. It's easy for me to take off, but not put on. Uh, it just gets irritated and my eyes just don't want to stay open. Especially like right after I like woken up. My eyes are still like weak and just wanting to sleep. So yeah. <laughs> Alright, so buds, I love you. And I hope you're enjoying the vlog. Good night for now. Good night, Strawberry Buds.
I'm black. He, he is black. I am black. And I'm white. My darn uh, leg piece keeps sliding down. It's so annoying. Thank you. Close it, close it. Okay. How do you survive in all that leather? Carefully, uh, PVC vinyl. Oh, that's amazing. Because I need pockets. Yes, definitely. My Harley doesn't have any pockets. No, it's Harley a one-piece clown suit. And like, I cannot carry any of my own. Yes. I need a handboard. Go for it. My boyfriend's going to be here with Constantine later because he's got the coat pockets and mm. pants pockets and so shirt pockets. Him. So I'm just, will you hold my stuff? It's over, Anakin. I have the high ground. <laughs> Every time I see an Anakin, you know it. Every time. Thorn. My like, piece keeps sliding off. There's always something that goes wrong with the cosplay. Am I right? Darn, my like, piece. Seriously. Hug your mother. I know I'm not your number one hero or Michael today, but I'm Hercules, so that's okay. All together. Go beyond, boss! Ultra! Boss! Ultra! Damn, there's no way you're not a YouTuber, too. I feel like I heard your voice somewhere. I don't know, I haven't heard a YouTube video. I swear I heard you doing a voice. Everybody knows me from somewhere. But who thinks who thinks you should have a YouTube channel? Probably. I would subscribe. Class 1A, 1B, and that one guy. Selfie. I got you, I got you. Hit it! Excuse me. Excuse me, Barney. Messing up all them damn ladies. I'll take that. Let me get, let me get that money right quick. Let me get that gold. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, no. oh God! Oh God! Hey, Spider-Man. You out here stepping on all these kicks, man? Baku, you, you really messed it's a up. Pro moment. It's a pro moment. Oh really my yes. God! No! Feel it, bro. 
brother. No, you get back in there. You hold that. You can do it. <laughs> Beat up that trash can, actually. Beat it. <laughs> Is that Rock Lee? Rock Lee, you better get in there. Boom. Oh. Give me a good flex. Ooh. <laughs> I'll ship. Mermaid man and barnacle boy. Evil. Oh, you're beautiful. Ooh. Ooh. That. Lovely darling. Work it. Ooh. Ooh, yes. Give me your sexiest poses. Ooh. Ooh, kill him. Ooh. <laughs> Let's make it awesome. Hey, morning. Oh my god, your wig. Oh, thanks. Morning, fair dogs. Hey. <laughs> I didn't think she was right there. Like. Thank you for thank you for the breakfast, by the way. It's very nice of you. It's the last day of MegaCon. And the first day of Christmas. <laughs> it's the last day of MegaCon. Let's do this. I'll be your body shield, Dr. Jones. <laughs> Throw a banana at him. How <laughs> dare you? Ha <laughs> ha, I'm faster than you. <laughs> Hold on my ear. <laughs> How's it going, Paradox? Hey. Good. I actually like it's this good. Right. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Yeah. 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 Alright guys, enjoy. Thank you, sir. See ya. See ya, Indiana. <laughs> what I missed? Just our ending. Just the ending. I got a prop check. You need to check these guns right here. <laughs> Make sure they're safe for the con. I don't want to get in trouble. Are you okay with that? Yeah, man. Let's okay. <laughs> making sure. I've been hitting the... I've been doing the squat.
And that's why he gets paid. <laughs>
probably means fighting through to the end, even if your situation doesn't look very well, as long as you go beyond. Being a hero means kissing your homies goodnight. For me, honestly, you know, I don't really like agreeing with Deku, but, um, you know, it powers or not, man. You know, if some, something's not right, and you have the power to change it, I feel like that's what makes you here. You know, helping people, even though nobody really wants to. People, when they're in danger, and you just rush in, don't think about it, just help them, you know? Especially that joy of just feeling that, you know, I did something good, and somebody's happy about that, you know? No matter how much recognition you get, it doesn't matter. Co complete selflessness, you know? Just, whoever's in front of you that needs the help, just do whatever you can. That's all I personally feel a hero should do. To make sure the villains know that their days are numbered. To protect everyone in this world. And to be a hero would probably be just to touch someone's life in the smallest way. Saying hello to someone on a bad day. Thank you. What do you say? How's it going? I want to die. A lot of cosplayers do after the con. Why well, am wearing like a lot of black here? Like so I am black. Oh. Ah. <laughs> You're not wearing. Oh. <laughs> So, how was your Megacon experience, Bloody Psych? Yeah, it was good. I mean, I did everything I needed to do. Um, it was on like a whim of like maybe what, 50 bucks? Mm -hmm. I was like, I didn't think this through at all. Oh, the shade. Me dying. <laughs> I lost my voice. Sorry, vlog. You're not gonna see me for a minute because I'm dying. Nicole, how was your experience at Megacon? My experience. Well, let's let me let's see. Okay, so my ex my experience. I got a migraine today. It's terrible. I'm Fuck. sorry about that. I hope you feel. Hey, I took care of you. So much editing. So much. Yeah. But it's gonna look great. Yeah. All the hours of editing all yeah. doubled down to only five it's, minutes it's of content. Stress I'm looking forward to. Stress I'm looking. Yes, forward I'm looking to. forward to because it's gonna be fun editing all of that. Something great. Something beautiful. Something. I think I dislocated my left ankle. How did you do that? I'm flat footed and I walk too damn much. Your voice sounds like Chucky thrown through a cheese grater. Do we turn that way or no? Your voice is really gone. I told you, I've been screaming at everything and everyone. You sound like an old man or something. I suck at it. <laughs> I love the young people. Back in my day, we didn't have everything. You didn't 
didn't have anime comics. Back in my day, we didn't have anime We just go down to the old swimming hole and drown Billy. Billy was fun to drown. Billy was fun to drown. I remember one time, little Billy, he was out there just flopping around in that water. And we, just, we just watched him we go just down. Him. We just tied bricks to his ankles and threw him in. Sometimes I like to sit in the shore and eat chocolate while I watch Billy gasp for air for hours. It was a fun time, a simpler time. A I'm time to be remembered. A much of it. And now we got these illegal, illegal candy salesmen, I swear to God. And every time I want to buy a chocolate bar, I got somebody bootlegging out next to me. I just want to buy an official chocolate bar. Paradox, how was your whole Megacon experience? My whole Megacon experience. Wow, that's quite a lot to put into words. Um, I would say that my whole Megacon experience would probably be summed up as awesome. And Thursday was awesome because I got to meet Ruby, meet Ruby for the first time. Uh, Friday, I met a bunch of other people I'd never met before, so that was always cool and fun. Uh, got to shop around a little bit too. Uh, Saturday, went to a really interesting, con uh, not a convention, but I went to a really interesting uh, battle simulation thing. Learned a lot about Hollywood uh, and Hollywood fights and the work put into those types of fights. So that's really fun. And today, beautiful Sunday, I went to the uh, My Hero Academia panel, which had both Bakugo and Todoroki in it. That was really fun. Uh, Bakugo and Midori. I'm oh, sorry, Midori. Yes. <laughs> You're good. What did I say, Todoroki? Yeah. I wish he was there. I wish he was there yeah, too. Totally. But no, he was, he was not there. Yeah. What was like your favorite highlight out of all of it? If you pick just one thing that really made oh, Megacon. The traffic. <laughs> the traffic. The traffic. The traffic. The traffic. The traffic was beautiful. Thank you so much for watching, and a very big thank you to Nightmare for helping me film, as I got the chance to involve myself on screen more and fully enjoy the special moments I had at the convention. Also a big thank you to my bud Mikkel for doing the same and filming for me in a few scenes. It really helped take away the stress and hassle of having to multitask filming for the vlog while genuinely taking the time to connect with beings, taking photos, and just embrace the experience. It was awesome getting to meet and hang with each and every one of you epic beings that are seen in the video, as well as others behind the scenes that may instead have been captured in a photo that's posted on my Instagram. Overall, Megacon 2019 was such an amazing experience to me and look forward to many more there and at other cons if I'm able. Be sure to like if you enjoyed, and subscribe for more content. Hitting the little bell button to get notified. Your support means a lot to me, and makes a huge positive difference with my motivation for what I do. I am truly grateful for that. Stay epic, strawberry buds. May much goodness come your way, and I'll see you all in my next video. Love you all. You too can become a hero! Don't listen to him! Stay epic and plus a